What is going on guys, Loco here and welcome to episode 10 of Local Legends and you just saw me here buying Antonio Valencia and selling Aaron Lennon because Aaron Lennon didn't live up to the expectation I had to him so uh, I decided it was time for him to go and uh, then I also bought myself a Garrett Bale, the 81 version of him because he's a bit cheaper at this stage and uh, just to have a little rotation system going on here on the midfield and uh, then I also went and bought myself a Mikel for 350 coins which is very cheap because he is a, actually a pretty good player and uh, very good for a rotation system and I also bought myself a Mikel Ateta for 700 coins which is again very cheap you see people buying him for two three thousand so uh, I was pretty excited about the buys I made here but yeah I decided to sell my rare bronze striker and then I went into a game against this guy here and I was absolutely dominating this game but I really had problems uh, scoring which was uh, kind of annoying but um, just before halftime I get some nice play through and a nice shot by Ateta which uh, hits the bow post but uh, Benmer takes the return puts it in the back of the net and I finally scored and uh, here I'm just showing you some uh, halftime stats and um, as you can see I have the majority of possession and uh, nine shots on goal and all these which didn't went inside the target were shots that just went by the post all my players didn't seem to be able to hit the inside the inside the, uh, the goal which was quite annoying and uh, yeah when I finally got it inside, it hit the post, so uh, I was quite frustrated, and then I made a mistake here, holding in the LB button when I went for the rebound, so uh, there's easy save for the keeper, but um, then he got this second yellow card for Sylvester, and uh, that kind of opened up his center back, and uh, made me some quite easy goals, as you see here, Nicholas Bender is way free inside the middle, and can easily put this into 2 now. and um, as you can see, it's 81 minute I had hard time scoring in this game but I was absolutely dominating but a little later got a got a nice goal here by Joe puts it in to 3-0 and um, I think I managed to put in one more goal and uh, this was actually the first game I have ever played where uh, my opponent didn't have a single shot on goal he simply couldn't get the ball and he Every time it went on my side of the half, he didn't stood a chance, and uh, you just saw Joe put it in for four 0 which was the end of the end of that game, and um, yeah, pretty nice result for me. Getting back to a good uh, good thing here, and then I bought myself a Balotelli for thirteen hundred coins, and uh, he's a pretty good striker, uh, pretty strong, has a pretty nice pace, and a relatively good uh, shot as well. He can also make some good goals. And then I went up against this dude, an all Brazilian team, which you see quite often, but um, this guy wasn't really the best. And um, once again, I was uh, I was dominating this game and um, had problems, but here he made a mistake and uh, put it out to Joe and uh, hammers this ball in. Keeper stood no chance and uh, again 1-0 up. Bit lucky on how I got the goal, but uh, I will take it. If you make a mistake, I will punish it if I uh, can't score. But this is a very good, very good play through and uh, <laughs> make it into the middle and a <laughs> fantastic save by his keeper. I don't know how he did that, but uh, I really loved the way the ball went up the field here. Everything just went how it should be and then, yeah, I don't know. But um, yeah, because I didn't score there, Big Aga went up and heads it in for the 2-0 at the, at the corner afterwards, which was quite satisfying since I really felt like that the... Uh, the, the play before deserved the goal so uh, when I got the goal I, wa I was happy and then here again some pretty nice pretty nice play through and uh, puts it in with the uh, with a very nice uh, back heel I think it's called a Rabona kick and uh, it would have been nice if it would have went in but unfortunately no but uh, just in the 90th minute Garrett Bale gets through and hammers this ball in with his First goal for, for the club in his first game, which was pretty nice, but uh, yeah, 3 0 and pretty nice win here. And uh, I was pretty excited about that again. And yeah, it takes a bit long here, but the next guy you will see me go up against that will be on the screen in a sec 
he had an all Everton side with Dimitar Berbatov, which was kind of weird because why would you have a player not for Everton when you're playing an all Everton side? But uh, he also had five informed players, actually six. Uh, he also had a Dembaba on the bench, and uh, it was kind of a struggle, but um, I was. I don't know what to say about this game. I started out really well with Michel Bastos getting in on goal and puts this into the back of the net. But um, he had a Luis Saha uh, in form. And he's very, very fast and had a, has a very, very good shot. But um, yeah, he got uh, got a header on a corner, which is which I don't like in these kind of games. If you have a pretty fair game, equal, and... Uh, and then you score most of your goals on headers, it's just annoying. But here you saw some skill from Luis Saha, just runs down the pitch and puts it in. And then right after the kickoff, I uh, get this ball up here. With uh, Balotelli gets through on goal and hammers this in as well. And that was also pretty nice. See, I like this goal. It was a nice play through and a nice uh, first touch by Balotelli. But then on the next kickoff, is Saha again very very fast and apparently my keeper can't save shit I really have most of the play most of the game in this match I have most chances most uh, most ball possession and uh, it was just a uh, just a shame but uh, I managed to get the equalizer with Bentner and um, yeah there wasn't more chances in the in the normal normal time and uh, I decided that I was so cocky I played well this day and um, I felt that I was a better player than this dude. He may have had the better team, but uh, I decided, okay, I will go for it because I deserve this. And then he substituted his uh, his uh, back forward and put in his informed Dembaba and uh, got a corner again. And yeah, I, could, I hate corners in this in these games. You know, when he scored two goals in corners, that's just a shame. I did manage to get one more chance here in the end, which I probably should have scored on, but a good save by uh, by Howard in the goal. And uh, unfortunately, I lose this game for free. But um, yeah, that's the end of this episode. Please thumb it up if you enjoyed it. Other than that, I will see you guys later. Bye bye.